Yo, what's going on, buddy? Welcome back to some more Assassin's Creed Mirage. Uh, in the last episode, we killed a general called Auruk. Auruk. Um, and in this episode, we're gonna go find another guy. I don't know what his name is, but we're gonna go kill that guy. And then, I, I should not have died right here. Uh, we're gonna go kill that other guy. And then I... I think after that is the main, not the main main guy, but the main guy, if that makes sense. Um, so if you guys enjoyed, leave a like and let's get into it. All right. Can't believe I died twice already from this. Um, what to talk about first? Uh. Oh yeah. I don't think so. Has technology made us lazy? That's what that's what I'm that's what I'm gonna talk about today. Um to me, I think I think people got too accustomed to doing things quick and easy and technology just made it very convenient for them to do all of that. Um like the, the lifestyle of having a having technology is just like having a map a map would go in, instead of like knowing where to go and remembering where to go you would just put it into a map and then it would just tell you to go wherever that you're trying to go um and also it Technology made it so much easier to get grocery, food, um, anything you want delivered to you, basically. And like, imagine, imagine, um, turning off the lights. People are now turning off the lights with Alexa. Oh, my Alexa just, okay, oops. Alexa, stop. Should not have said that word. Uh... Uh-huh. Okay. Um, yeah. And people are just too, I think, too dependent. Like, me included. Too dependent on searching up stuff or having having the ability to search up things instead of remembering it. But I don't, I don't... No, directing all shipments to a location just south. Uh-huh. Okay. Like, I don't do, like... I don't remember anything. Like, I don't try to remember nothing. And if I need anything, I'll just search it up. Um, where is it way in? Where's ah? Uh, here we go. All right. Um, there's a lot of red stuff here. A lot of fire. Wait. I thought I killed... I thought the last guy, the Auruk guy, was the guy with the ship. But I guess this guy is a ship. Oh. Okay. I, I thought I thought I did the, the scare guy first, and then... Wait, so... Oh, no. I did do the scare guy get first. This guy is the, the one that wasn't scared of anything. He... Because he has his fleet of ship. To, to retreat to or not. The other guy was just favored by by, by the, the leader or the boss man. Huh. Well, whatever. Um and I okay, so back 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 on back on topic. Um I think te technology just made things too easy. Like for instance Technology made it way too easy for people to... People, when I say people, I mean woman. To, to end... To end relationship. Or or start another one, you know? Whichever it is that they're trying to do is... is I guess it's not just for women. I guess it's like for man and woman. Like, for both gender. But usually... 
female get more attention than you know males do like that's just that's just facts like nobody care about a guy like just a random guy but if you're pretty enough anyone everyone will look at you it, it don't matter like who you are or whatever if you're a good looking guy i guess everyone will look at you and stuff but does anyone really get like want to date you seriously i don't think so like yeah for for, for like the first sounds like i gotta burn his ship to lure him out i think because oh yeah wait because he's he's in his in his bunker right yeah okay okay um yeah like good looking guys there are good looking guys and like some some good looking guys are like that, ha that have money are very like rare but then you don't really as a good looking guy that's give you like a little nudge a little edge to, to like the competition or whatever but besides that i think i think the female will date you for a little bit if you're broke date you for a little bit and then if you're not doing anything with your life or you know how have your stuff together they'll leave and this is more uh, i think it's more common that should how did that miss auto aim get your get your stuff together like i think that's more common in like like um miami and stuff like that's more common in over in that region miami la um new york bro i saw a fresh and fit episode yesterday while i was working and this girl she was she was a new yorker and she has no concept of money no concept of the real world basically see females can be ignorant and ha don't know nothing that's a little rude or a little mean but like that's just how it is she was so just beyond help basically most of them were too most of them were too like nobody had any concept of money but she was the worst because she was like oh uh, it's only seven hundred thousand dollar i was like what like so so for context she want they they asked um everyone like uh what do you what do you want in a man and all that stuff and they were like going around the table and everyone want basically everyone want a millionaire everybody want a millionaire except for one one girl where she said it was okay for her man to make eighty thousand, which i was like ah w go go you but that was eighty thousand is still like pretty high because the the minimum i think is around 35 to 50 if i remember correctly um if you guys want to watch it uh it'll be the latest episode i think or with the latest episode with like the females and stuff um but that one girl from new york i i think that it was sister i think there was two of them there was two female that think money just appeared like i swear i swear to god you can't make this up she said it's only seven thousand dollar everyone's a millionaire i was like hmm <clears throat> I was like, hold up. Who's everyone? Maybe, maybe in, because New York is so like, um, such an expensive place to live. That everyone, you know, has, is rich. And is New York is really business savvy, you know? That's just New York. And everyone, you know, do whatever it takes to, to get money and to, to survive and whatnot. Because New York is a harsh place to live um and there's white there's a not white oh there's um a lot not a lot but a lot of racist people <laughs> like i lived in new york for a little but not in like this is this wasn't it wasn't in like new york new york you know it was on the outskirts i don't remember what it was because i was a little you know a little kid but like 
going to school there was the worst. Everyone was, bro. At first, it was like, oh, he's exotic. Basically, basically, that's how it was. I was like the only Asian, and I would, get, I was like an exotic animal in the beginning. And then after a while, they're like, ah, this guy, he don't know nothing, because I didn't know, I don't know, I didn't know, Jack. I didn't know how, like, I can speak, but reading was like, for some reason, I just didn't read. Or I didn't know how to read. I don't. I don't know what happened. I didn't even know the date. Like on the on the question, they were like, "What is the date?" I remember. I didn't even know what it was. I was like beyond dumb. Like I'm not smart now, but like back then it was bad. Um, hey, back back to <laughs> that's sorry about the ramble. Um, yeah, that girl. He thinks that oh it's easy to make seven seven hundred thousand a year, but but then like they pulled up like statistics about what what kind of man she want and it's like the kind of man she wants and what the kind of man they all want is like six feet or five eleven five eleven to six feet and. She wasn't even good looking, bro. I, on my, on my life, she was kind of ham. Or her sister was, kinda, her sister was ham. She wasn't. She was like, eh. But you, and Wait, she, uh, she. Let us hear from Basim first. Ah when shoot! Now I gotta listen to this. General Jasur, um. Nader are dead. Did you find anything to identify Almar de Juar? Not exactly. General oh, I think that's the that's the final guy. Alder Mahwa. It seems his past finally caught up with him. Admiral Nader was questioned about missing supply shipments meant for the Turkic military. Almar de Juar was not happy. So, Almar de Juar is at the Great Garrison overseeing supplies for the Turkic mercenaries. There is only one officer of sufficient <laughs> rank who fits. Warlord Wasif at Turkey. Wasif? This makes sense. There are few others who could have taken Beshi. Oh, Beshi even taken? He never came back. Bro, but it's because it's your fault. This guy, bro, I I hate this guy so much. And we're giving him the not what are, what are we giving? We're giving him the And that is where I am going. Basically, we're doing the hard work and he's getting all the the value or the whatever he wants from it, it could start a war that the the credit the there it is yeah, yeah, yeah. he will he's getting all the credit Fine. such bs i will meet basim near the garrison before i move but do not take long i am finished waiting see and he's so needy bro i just want to mm, suck him in his throat and kill god he must not escape and it must look like ali did it the safety of alamo <laughs> It will uh, be done. We should just end him. Honestly. I'll take over. But back on topic. Yeah, she delusional. Hey, hey I forgot. Are you ready? And who are you to tell me what I can and cannot do? There is more at stake here than your pride, Wasif. We walk a narrow path. Enough! I did not expect him to look like that with that voice. I will not suffer such but that, that voice don't match his face. Oh, someone just walked right through him. He doesn't care. But, but, bro, let's just, I'm just gonna go back to, like, the woman is beyond, beyond saving. Like, it was like a 1%, or less than 1%, because she won, a, I don't know, I remember specifically, but I'm pretty sure it's either 1% or less. That's the kind of guy she wants. And then afterwards, she didn't want to change her mind. I was like, okay. Yep. Okay, buddy. Uh, be delusional. But be, like woman woman, they can be delusional and that's fine. That's that's fine. And yeah. And what about technology, how it makes uh it makes it easier for women to move on and find another man? Is because women tend to get a lot more emotion like emotional support from men. What will you do? So that's why like everyone is okay or female is so okay with just leaving right right after 
or so what leaving and then go into another relationship or leaving the guy that she's with and find another person to to support her emotionally or whatever that she wants because there's so many guys that will do that but then there's only so many guy that she will want that from but getting the attention on social media is good enough for her basically um but yeah um i think i'm gonna end the episode there on a cliffhanger honestly uh because because then i this is gonna take a whole long time this whole castle thing yeah um so if you guys have enjoyed uh if you guys think what i've talked about is interesting in any way if you want to know what i was talking about or not to know but what i've talked about about how the little, little female is like delusional and all that stuff uh go watch fresh and fresh and fit most of my like most of my point and stuff is basically from them they're like great on on these kind of stuff uh but yeah if you guys have enjoyed agreed or disagreed leave what your thoughts are in the comment and i'll see you guys next time